So I think um, in terms of the loss of the new technologies that we've seen coming in in the last few years, a lot of them are around um, different ways of collaborating, communicating. Um, they're perceived to be more consumer friendly in terms of it enables you to work anywhere, enables you to link up with who you like, when you like. In practice, um, what we're finding is that um, unless you do a really big push with people to get the behavior change to happen, um, a lot of these technologies don't really embed properly. And the organizations then frustrated because they've got very low um, sort of penetration rate and, and the things like knowledge management if you don't have the critical mass. I think uh, if you look at the thing that Google, PayPal uh, have is they've got a massive customer base uh, and they're always throwing out new and interesting products uh, for those customers to, to use. Um, and, you know, I mean, PayPal's been a financial institution, a registered financial institution for about the last 10 years. So they've kind of got it uh, in a way that uh, retail financial institutions haven't. They, they're not encumbered by huge uh, ATM estates and branch networks uh, that having to get rid of. You know, they're, they're very nimble. It's a very nimble platform. Uh, and, and I think it, in many ways, uh, you know, they've had that advantage of starting from scratch 15, 20 years ago in the way that retail banks haven't. I think the other thing to say about both healthcare and finance is that um, um, on the one hand, the, the pace of change and innovation and the role of technology in driving that in both is, 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 is huge. You know, there's vast amount of new science, vast amount of new technology shifting healthcare and, and, and driving change. Um, but, but it is equally a very, very conservative um, uh, um, sector full of cultural and professional silos and um, things also happen very slowly in healthcare, um, which I think is probably the same here in, uh, in finance. So, so there are a lot of similarities actually between the two, I think. So I think technology plays a big role as far as global companies influencing social uh, agendas as well as the, their employees um, engaging with people on a very personal level while at the same time they're looking, the companies are looking to save on travel costs but at the same time build those global teams and virtual teams effectively. Mm -hmm.